da 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 But we're talking about the future, and I'm not talking about the future now, but I mean after Motown. Um, we're talking about the 70s and the 80s, and then from the 80s into the 90s, where soul, again, soul is there, but it, it begins to get its own life. And so when we talk about about music that is heavily influenced by soul today, a group that I think of is TLC. TLC is a hip-hop rap group that I listened to in the 90s and 2000s um, and they they really redefine and really stretch the boundaries of what is African American music and can can it be listened to and respected by people of all walks of life and TLC did exactly that they did exactly that in large part because even though they were a hip hop and a rap group um they were heavily influenced by soul. I will even go so far as to say that they are a current soul group. A contemporary soul group? I'm going to go I'm going to go ahead and say it. I'm going to go ahead and say it. Uh, but maybe someone else on the internet will disagree with me. And of course, that's what the internet is for. It's for people to disagree with each other about everything. Um boys to men. Another group that I listened to in the, in the 90s, <laughs> um, but heavily influential. And a lot of people would not consider Boys to Men to be soul. But actually, if it weren't for soul, there wouldn't be this group, Boys to Men. So Boys to Men, I would say definitely is sort of a more modern interpretation of soul. And then let's finish with this band, this group, Destiny's Child. You recognize this band, this group, Destiny's Child? Destiny's Child is often considered R&B with a little hip-hop and a little bit of rap. Mm, I would say they are heavily, heavily soul. Very heavily soul. They are soul sound. And very much inspired by kind of a new look at Mo the Motown sound. But there should be a face you recognize here. There should be a face that you recognize here. Uh, the, the woman in the middle, if you don't know who that is, that is Beyonce. Beyonce, that's right. Probably the biggest, most famous musical artists in the world today, certainly the most uh, uh, successful and, and the richest, of course. Um, and th she came out of Destiny's Child. She started singing with Destiny's Child. And when, the, when this group broke up, she went, of course, as an independent artist and just became her own mega empire, the Beyonce empire. And how would you define her sound? Well, again, very heavily influenced by soul. Destiny's Child, Beyonce. So that explains Destiny's Child and their sound goes all the way, all the way back to Motown and it goes all the way back to the beginnings of soul music 